Good morning, and thank you for joining us. Our morning outlook will focus on the BTC USD, recent developments, and the potential impact on the markets. Let's hear from Greg in our trading room. The Bitcoin dollar pair gained 2% in the last session after rising as much as 3.6% during the session. The stochastic indicator is giving a positive signal. The gold dropped 0.4% against the dollar in the last session. According to the stochastic RSI, we are in an overbought market. Apple shares rose 1% in the last session. The Williams indicator indicates an overbought market. The last session saw the Aussie gain 0.7% against the dollar. The Williams indicator indicates an overbought market. Coming up, today's major financial news. U.S. stocks hit a near two-week high after a softer producer prices data reinforced bets of an interest rate cut by the Federal Reserve in September. Mega cap and growth stocks gained, with Nvidia set to lead the charge for a second session, rising over 5%. The Canadian cryptocurrency trading platform EZBTC and its founder, David Smilly defrauded customers by misappropriating approximately $9.5 million of their cryptocurrency investments and using the funds for gambling. U.S. producer prices increased less than expected in July as the cost of services fell by the most in nearly 1.5 years amid signs of diminishing pricing power for businesses, evidence of waning inflation pressures that reinforced hopes of an interest rate cut next month. And now, let's review today's major economic events. The US Consumer Price Index will be released at 12.30 GMT, the UK's Consumer Price Index at 6 GMT, Japan's Gross Domestic Product at 23.50 GMT, the Eurozone's Industrial Production will be released at 9 GMT, Japan's Gross Domestic Product Annualized at 23.50 GMT, the Eurozone's Employment Change at 9 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day.